We told you last night about the scandal swirling around the Interior Secretary Ryan Zinke. According to new reporting by CNN, Zinke may once have suggested in private that he still believes in the meritocracy. That would make him the last person in power in this country who does. So, of course, it was highly controversial. Through a spokesman, though, Zinke denied that slander. Of course he doesn't believe in hiring on merit on the basis of who's more qualified or who has the most relevant experience or in any of those bigoted skills-based criteria. At the Department of the Interior, they hire on the basis of genetics, on what people look like. Ryan Zinke believes in diversity, just like everybody else. But of course, no one believed him. In an op-ed for CNN today, Andre Perry of the Brookings Institution said that Zinke's preference for qualified people could, quote, threaten the security of the country. Senator Bob Menendez of New Jersey recently returned from his federal corruption trial. Congratulations, Bob. Went even further than that. In a statement, Menendez accused Zinke of trying to create a, quote, lily white department. Well, there's obviously no worse crime than that. White departments being prima facie immoral, something a mad scientist thought up. And of course, Menendez would know himself being one of the single whitest members ever to serve in the U.S. Senate. He gets a pass on that, though, because whatever else you might say about Bob Menendez, he would never even consider hiring someone on the basis of relevant qualifications.